Look at this horse. Flesh torn from shattered bones. The smell of werewolves is overwhelming. They are all around us. Why don't they attack? Mm, they are toying with us, surrounding us. They will attack soon enough. It's a vampire! Staked through the heart. Is it holding another stake? Why would a vampire carry a stake? A civil war among the vampires? There's a werewolf carcass over here. Must have been quite a fight. Yori, we have come from village Falkenberg. We are traveling to Castle Gastad. I don't think anyone's home. The smell of life is fresh here. Someone was here recently, but he is gone now. Yori, we have come from village Falkenberg. We are traveling to Castle Gastad. Please come in. These woods are dangerous. Traveling to Castle Gostad, you choose a poor place to visit. Count Voiku does not welcome guests. We've come to stop Count Voiku. Kill him, if necessary. Dan, my prayers are with you. My mastery is over the forest. If I thought I stood a chance of beating him, I would have traveled to the castle years ago and killed the Count myself. I'm safe from him here. He avoids the forest and the werewolves that live here. In an ironic way, I owe those beasts my life. My people once were gypsies, well versed in the darker arts. One of our talents was the art of skinwalking. When we first fell under Voiko's thumb, a troop of our bravest men volunteered to wear the skin of the wolf and take to the forest to protect us from the Count. Eventually, 
you learn to make the winged ones that can pass over the forest instead of through it. The man-wolves grew restless, hungry. After centuries of walking as beasts, our protectors forsook their allegiance to us and grew feral. Our once warriors began to stalk us. They became as great a threat to us as Voiko himself. Now, only I survive. Those of my people not devoured by the wolves were taken by the vampires. Take whatever traps and medicines you think you can use. The traps can be used repeatedly. They are not lethal, but they can slow down the fiercest of beasts. Beware the traps I've hidden throughout these woods. Some are very lethal, and they do not discriminate between man and beast.